guys welcome back to yet another Grand Theft Auto 3 video so I'm over here at the Shoreside Vale hideout and that is because we are finally going to finish the last seven rampages in this video um, of course in the third island Shoreside Vale as you can see so yeah uh, go ahead grab yourself a vehicle and follow me and uh, hopefully I will help you get through all of these rampages because some of them are actually kinda tricky in my opinion uh, everybody's opinion is different, of course. But anyway, guys, let's go ahead and get started with the first rampage. Alright, guys, so right there where you just saw me uh, start this video, you're going to go ahead and grab a vehicle, and you're going to go through here. And you're going to stop your vehicle right here. And when you look down, you're going to see this uh, other roof. You're going to go ahead and jump onto it. And this is where you can obviously find the first rampage of this video. So let's go ahead and start it. Uh, of course, you gotta get 20 hood members with a shotgun. This is a pretty tricky one, in my opinion. It's always been a little tricky. I know you can probably get them from up here, but I don't think they spawn too much. So you're gonna have to go down. And, um, remember you have a time limit. So, yeah, you're just gonna keep clicking or shooting, uh, whatever, wh wherever you're playing this game on. And make sure you get some armor, because look at my health. I just started this. And all my armor's already gone. Um, so yeah, definitely some good old heart armor and full health will be very nice to complete this. Uh, don't stop shooting because these guys can get you in a blink of an eye. And um, even though they just app Uzis, they can still get you. Because this is not my um, first try. Um... The cool thing about rampages is that at least you do not get a um, wanted level, and you know wanted levels are not very hard to get away from, but they are quite annoying when you're doing something like this. And I know this is not the first rampage video uh, I've done. Um, I've done quite a lot actually, but since it's been a while since I made one, um, it's good to get back, you know, informing you guys how to do. All the basics. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the first rampage, as you can see. Um, let's go ahead and do the next one now. So, yeah, good luck on this one. Okay, guys, so another rampage can be found through here. You're going to go ahead and park your car. And uh, jump this fence. And the next rampage can be found around here. I think it was behind a sign. Let's see. Yeah, I remember this one. There it is. Alright, so let's go ahead and do it. This one could be a little bit tricky. Um, I believe... Do we have to kill these guys? No, because we have to get headshots. Oh no, this one was a pain. This one was hard. Alright, let's see. How am I going to do this? There we go. There goes one head. Yeah, I really don't like these... Rampages where we have to get headshots because I mean in PS2 it was a complete hell At least in PC I have the mouse cursor Which is what I use to obviously um, aim in this game it's Just trying to concentrate so excuse if I don't talk much All right, and the good thing is they they're not they're not a gang that hate you so they don't try to attack you for nothing or well, sometimes they do but not very often um, all right there we go and I think in the last rampage I mentioned these guys were Diablos well I don't they they're not um, I don't exactly know what gang these guys are um, I know a lot about DT3 you guys but I don't know everything oh crap Alright, so I need four more kills. Let's see if I can get these guys. Oh, I got two at one. Yeah. Alright, one more. And there we go. Rampage complete. Alright, next one. Alright, guys, so for the next rampage, this one, in my opinion, has always been a bit of a tricky one. You're going to go to this villa right here, or this mansion, whatever you want to call it. It's the one, I think it's the first one after you um, get out from those turn thingies. I'm trying to describe as much as possible to help you guys find the next rampage, which is this one. Alright, we have to fly 20 Colombians in 120 seconds. This one is a little tricky because Colombians are quite the badass gang that will kill you no matter what. 
And in this game, there's no such thing as being fireproof. Uh, that was that came in the later GTAs. Um, so yeah, it may be a little hard one. But yeah, fly 20 Colombians and just. Oh yeah, here. Oh god, great! I burned myself. What a wonderful fail, huh? All right. So you gotta be careful here, cause these guys carry Uzis. That's the very hard thing about this. I thought he was in burning. I was like, are you seriously fireproof, dude? Yeah, so there comes another one. I remember um, stuff like this was very fun, and it still is. And I also remember in Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories, um, I, I remember a... Uh, oh god, what is this? I remember a um, fire extinguisher pickup. Sorry, I was concentrating there. That was in to on top of a building. I uh, don't remember what building, but oh yeah, it was that building um, by Joy's Garage. Oh damn, I can't find the last three. I still have time though, and I would always pick up that flamethrower. And um, did I say fire extinguisher? Oh my god, I I fail a lot when I'm talking during my videos. When I'm like concentrating. Oh god, no. This is oh god. What is this? What is this? I just need... Come on, come on. If I can make it there... If... Come on, come on! Yes! I actually did this rampage with one... Oh my god. Well, guys, there you go. Next next one! <laughs> okay, guys. So the next rampage is actually one of the ones I hate the most. And it's over here next to the... Uh, police station and also the Cochrane Dam. You can find it through here. This is actually a jump, which is sweet. Uh, so here's the rampage. Let's go ahead and do it. This one is horrible, mainly because the gang members don't spawn very much, and when they do, they head towards you trying to kill you. There goes one, and we have to hit the heads. Um, I'm just trying to not be seen by them, so they don't come freaking running towards me and. It's just annoying. Alright, come on, I can get this guy in. Damn it, I can't. Um, now, one thing I forgot to mention is that every single rampage has a second location. So if you fail it, um, the rampage will not appear in the same spot, but in another one, which is most, most of the times easier and, um, well, made to be like a second spot. Aw, oh, damn it, I did not get his head. I just hate this one. It's so freaking complicated. So I'm gonna just, oh, there we go. There's a bunch of them down there. This is a thing they do in my game a lot. They just stand around like dead fish or something. Sometimes they end up moving. Sometimes they don't. As you can see, they're just they're he they're they're standing there looking down, doing nothing. They're already. They look like they're already. Look at this. Just. It's weird. I, I don't get it why they do this, but I guess I got lucky because this the main problem with this rampage is that they just don't respawn. But uh, I guess I got lucky this time because they're they're all over the place. Look at this last two, and there we go, rampage complete. So by the way, if you're a PS2 player, uh, this is gonna be very hard because I don't like how you aim in that game. It's just terrible. But anyway guys, that is this rampage. Let's go ahead and do the next one. And also, if you fail any rampages, uh, look in the description of this video because you can find the map uh, with all the A and B locations just in case uh, you don't know how to find them. So yeah, anyway, next one. Okay guys, so for the next rampage, uh, we're going to go over here to Pike Creek. This is where in uh, 1998 we did uh, missions for Donald Love. Of course, and in this, in this game we can find a rampage over here. Uh, so yeah, let's go and do it. For this one, I have a bit of a strategy. Um, for me, it's always very hard to drive by and uh, blow up vehicles. So what I just do is I just grab a bunch of vehicles. And they spawn all over the place, so don't worry about no vehicles spawning. Just grab at least seven vehicles. I know a lot of you know where I'm heading with this. Um, and just stack them up in one place like this and you have enough time I don't know why I did not grab that one you have enough time to do this so um, don't worry about time 
So just stack them up like that. Make sure they're very close to, to each other. Um, so I, I got a pretty good amount of vehicles here. So I guess we could just shoot this one already. Just shoot one. Like that. As you can see, there will be lots of vehicles that will be joining the party with us. So that one will escalate and blow up all of these ones, as you can see. And that's how it basically works in my case. You can keep on shooting these guys because, well, they're not really going to go anywhere. Right, so only one more vehicle remains. I'm just going to take this one over here. And just take it here. And blow it up. It says you have to drive by them, but you don't really have to do that. All you have to do is shoot the freaking vehicles with the Uzi. And there you go. That is pretty much it. It's a very easy and fast way to complete this one because I know a lot of people have a tr lot of trouble with this one, especially PC users. So yeah, guys, next one. All right, guys, so for the next rampage, I'm right next to the airport here. You're going to want to unmount your car next to this tunnel. And if you run back here uh, a little bit forward, there is the next rampage of this video. This one is a little bit, ugh, I, I don't like it much. Um, we have to run over 20 Colombians with a car. And of course you can always find this taxi cab sitting right here. So yeah, let's go ahead and uh, do this. So, oh there we go. They spawn pretty quick, which is a good thing. So, I've already gotten 7 down, which is actually a very good thing compared to how I did in the past. Uh, Alright, let's see. Oh, only six left. I guess it's not that hard after all. Remember, I have not played this game since uh, a few years, so... I have definitely increased my... my um, rampage skills in the past few years, so yeah. Alright, easy. Next one. Alright guys, so opposite of one of the rampages we did, uh, that one, we can find this area, which is where we will find the last rampage of this video. And also a hidden package, as you can see up there, so I have to collect that. Uh, head up these stairs, and uh, you're going to find the last rampage. Right there. This one is actually not very easy, because, well, not many cars spawn too much. I'm trying to get those back there. Oh, whoa, that looked sweet. Long shot. Whoop, whoop. Here comes another one. Oh, they seem to be spawning a lot back there. Oh, where do you think you're going? Alright. So once again, if you fail this one... Oh, whoa, look at those pedestrians. If you fail these, uh, there's always a B location. You can go find that uh, in the map that is in the description. A good thing to do is to kill cops. Uh, they will attract cop attention, and of course that will bring cop cars. Uh, so you can see one right there. If they wouldn't... There we go, got that guy. Alright, nice. There we go. Come on, last one. And there we go, all rampages completed, and we get... I think a million dollars. I'm not sure. If not, it was a hundred thousand. But yeah, guys, that is also about it for every single rampage uh, over all over the map. Uh, so I hope this video helped you out. Once again, uh, if you fail the rampage, it will be respawning at a different location. If, and if you don't know how to get to that different location, the map will be in the description for every single island and, of course, every single rampage video. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed also watching me destroy people and stuff. So uh, I will see you in my next video. And for now, uh, keep calm and stay boss. Adios, people.